At the School of Media, Film and Journalism here in Coraine, we've built the next generation of media production facilities. This includes high-definition television studio, radio studios, joint green screen for interactive production, and we've also built the largest newsroom in Northern Ireland. The facilities have been rated independently by the National Council for the Training of Journalists as amongst the very best in the UK, and that's a fantastic endorsement of what we've done here. The new facilities are made for the next generation of the curriculum that we need. So it will mean that the students learn on the type of equipment and that the industry is not looking for for today, but the industry is looking for the students to have skills in for tomorrow. And this will give them a great advantage when it comes to going out into the workplace, uh, but also an advantage when it comes to learning what's going to be coming in the future in terms of media. Uh, and this will give them the opportunity if they wish to, to go on to set up their own companies or projects and so forth. And that gives them a, what we call first mover advantage uh, when it comes to their graduation and how they kind of plan out their careers. Hello, I'm Maggie Swarbrick and I teach broadcast journalism at Ulster University. Um, we're really lucky to live in Northern Ireland, not just because it's really beautiful, but because we have a rich tradition here of journalism because of the history. And we have a real and proper understanding of why journalism is important and why words matter. So if you come to study journalism at Ulster University, I'll be teaching you broadcast skills in our radio studio and our TV studio, and hopefully passing on my belief that journalism is a really great career choice. My name is Leona O'Neill. I'm a lecturer in journalism here at Ulster University. Journalism is one of the most rewarding and exhilarating jobs in the world. Through journalism, you can change lives. You can impact society positively. You can do good, you can help. Journalism is a noble and proud profession and one from which you will get great reward. No two days are the same in journalism. You will meet the most extraordinary people from politicians to celebrities to ordinary people in your community doing the most extraordinary things every single day. Here at Ulster, you will learn to be the very best journalist you can possibly be. In my classes, you will learn about news writing and news gathering, where to get the news and how to do the very best job with the story and the voice that you've been trusted with. In public affairs, you will learn how the world really works. Future journalists, you will be able to see the first draft of history, witness history unfold before your eyes. You'll be able to give a voice to the voiceless. You'll be able to shine a light in dark places and hold those in power to account. There is never a dull moment in journalism. But don't just take my word for it. Here are some friends of Ulster University Journalism who will tell you why we need good journalists now more than ever. Hello everyone. Um, why is journalism so important? Because you can make a powerful difference in Northern Ireland. You can change people's lives. You can improve people's lives. You can stop bad people affecting good people. Um, you can create things. You can care. You can worry. You can cry. You can laugh. It's the most extraordinary job in the world. You know, there are some jobs that you go out and when you come back home and you're not sure if you can make a difference. You'll not make a difference every day in journalism. No way. Some days will be boring. Some days will be mundane. It is a job after all. You'll enjoy your holidays. You'll enjoy time off. But by God, you are in a profession where sometimes, if you care, you'll make a huge difference. So if you've got fire in your belly, if you've got passion, but most importantly, if you care, you're in the best job in the world. Hi Leona, uh, I'm in Beirut in Lebanon at the moment, working on a project here. Let's go and have a look. See Simon here who's editing. Mm -hmm. How's it going? <laughs> That's fine. That's what we're up to. Uh, being a journalist is the best job in the world because uh, I've never been bored doing this job. Um, each day is generally new uh, and it's constantly stimulating. It's basically going out there, you know, tr trying to find out interesting things, get interesting content and um, had a lot of fun doing it. You know? My name's Patricia Delvin and I'm a crime journalist with the Sunday World newspaper. We are living in an age where misinformation and lies can travel around the world quicker than ever before. We need good journalists to counteract that. We live in a society where very powerful people, some of whom don't like democracy, try to control things. 
We need good journalists to fight against that, to speak truth to power. We still live in a society where some communities are controlled by criminals. Those criminals use violence, intimidation, drug dealing, extortion to take away the voice of the most powerless. We need to be there to give those people a voice. My name is Derva MacDonald and I'm a journalist from Newry County Down, although I spent most of my gosh, near 17 year career as a journalist working um, from Dublin and from other locations. Our job essentially is to be involved in writing the first draft of history. It's not always easy and it can often be quite messy, but it is an extraordinary privilege, a privilege like no other, to be part of that first draft, to be writing about the times that we live in, to bear witness to everything that is happening and to hold power to account. I often think that as journalists, we are the permanent opposition. Governments come and go, they rise and fall, but when we're doing our job and doing it well, we're still here, we're still kicking. Hi Ulster University, I'm David Blevins from Sky News and I'm having a sneaky little day off because I know that the new lockdown and the Brexit negotiations are going to interrupt my Christmas and New Year but I'm afraid that comes with the territory of this job. It's certainly not nine to five but on the bright side no two days are ever the same. We need good journalists for three reasons. A, because the current business model where everything is driven by algorithms is replacing credibility with clickbait. B, because we need someone to hold power to account. The only people with anything to fear from good journalism are those with something to hide. In fact, they tend to be the only people who attack journalism as well. I think it was Thomas Jefferson who said, when the speech attacks the free press, you're listening to the words of a tyrant. And C, because we've discovered all over again in the last three or four years that bombastic sound bites like take back control or make America great again are no substitute for substantive discourse. And it's good journalism that drives those healthy conversations. Hi, I'm Kelly Allen. I'm originally from Belfast, but I've spent the last 15 years living in London, working for numerous publications, including the Daily Mirror, The Sun, the Daily Mail, Fabulous Magazine, New Magazine, Grazia, Hate, Closer, Best Magazine. And I also write a weekly showbiz column for The Sunday Life. We need journalists because we are important for getting the story out there, like educating people, telling them the news. We need people who tell the news stories, the politics stories, the sports stories. Entertainment is sometimes dismissed as a bit frivolous and silly, but actually it's much more than that. We lift the paper, we give it the glamour. Never before has it been more important in a year where news is really miserable. It's the entertainment, it's the silly stories that make the paper come to life and actually lift the mood. It's also a way to educate people. I've interviewed celebrities like Colleen Nolan about, about breast cancer. I've interviewed celebrities about their mental health, really removing the stigma of speaking out and why it's okay to get help. And I think, I think people read these stories these, that celebrities have gone through and relate to them and then they feel okay about talking out. Being a journalist is a really fulfilling career for me. I've loved every day of it. Um, Eamon Holmes always tells you, if you find a job you love, you never work a day in your life. And I feel like that. I love going to work every day. I really enjoy what I do. And I hope when you get out there and start working as a journalist, you enjoy as much as I do whatever field you go into. I think it's vital. Journalism is, is a vital part of democracy. I, I think there, are, there, are, there is right and wrong in the world. I think it's important that, um, um, Power and powerful people are held to account. Um, it's too easy for, for, you know, for power to corrupt. I think it's important for us to to show to show to the audience what's happening. And they don't have the time to go out and ask the tough questions they might like to. Um, that's that's what we do. And we can bring that information to people and we can enlighten people and we can help people, we can enrich their lives and hopefully we can help broadly in people's lives. So there you have it. You now know why we need good journalists more than ever. If you have a hunger for information, if you have a passion for news and for doing good, if you're driven and determined and really interested in journalism, we want to hear from you. You can contact us through our website, ulster.ac.uk. We'd love to hear from you.